Today, I'm gonna show you how I created fire sign. I was inspired by this picture, so I wanted to put my own spin on it. First, you have to start by doing the French, as you can see here. It's kind of hard to explain it, so I hope the visuals help. I usually start with a small bead towards the center, and I work my way down and go like cutting towards the centers, if that makes sense. I, ho I hope this makes sense. And once we finish the application, then we have to go with the filing. Make sure these edges are crisp because the next step, it's gonna show if you didn't do this properly. Now I'm going in with this custom orange glitter that I made. Yes, that I made, custom acrylics coming soon. And I did a little time lapse just so you guys can see how smooth this acrylic is. When I tell you I'm obsessed with these glitter acrylics, like I have it in orange, I made blue, I made yellow, I made pink. The list goes on. But we're gonna keep filing, keep filing, keep filing. I finished the application off camera, but I'm going in with the base coat just to make sure all the ridges are covered. For this part, we're doing a 3D reptile print. So just follow along with me doing these little lines along the sides. We're gonna take the glow in the dark acrylic powder, pour it over the top to make the 3D effect. And then I pop it in the dryer because we have to make sure our design is secure. Now, I'm going with diamonds and pearls because as a fire sign, you know we have to pop out and just be extra. It's what we do. It's literally what we do. I finished the rest of this process off camera since there's so many diamonds involved. But after you do these diamonds, make sure you secure this by popping them in the LED lamp. The LED lamp is going to be your best friend with these. At this point, I was so excited. I couldn't wait to put them on and show you guys. So I just, I just had to. I had to. And this is Fireside. When I tell you I'm obsessed with these, like, oh, link in bio. Shop yours today. Try to make the skin